Yeah, we're going to go to the front headlock switch and the front headlock meter. Before we do the front headlock switch, I want you to quickly just practice your pivoting. The pivot is essential on this technique. When I say pivot, I'm talking about being on one knee, taking the brake off because the brake is my foot. That's a pivot. Because when I do this technique, I'm going to be here like this. We're going to do the arm dragon, but I can't arm drag him until I throw my leg. So I throw this leg, I break his off, I throw, and I arm drag him so he'll literally go flying past me from having me in the front headlock to me being a top referee. Okay, so let me down with me for a second. Just practice this move. It seems silly, I guarantee you're going to goof it up. Let's try it. Forward, backwards. Forward, backwards. See how far you can get. <laughs> Don't put your brake on until you stop moving. Right? Let the other foot hit first. That foot hits, then the brake goes back on. Hits, then brake. Hits, then brake. Okay? That's super important for a lot of our sit outs and switches. Reverse switches and all that stuff comes with pivot involved. Pretty much all of those. Alright, so <clears throat> into the headlock switch. Just nice. Now, they also got me in the front head. Like, I'm the front now, other people may know this is a lookout switch. And that's fine. There's a reason for that. When I come up here and grab his elbow, I'm reaching with the arm that's trapped, the one he has secured on the front headlock. I'm coming up here on his elbow and shows his trap area. And I'm going to pull it in. But when I pull it in, at the same time I pull it in, I'm going to look out. Right over here, AJ, I'm going to pull and put my ear right into his chest. This takes away all the chokes and things like that. I don't want to do it out here. Okay. Put in my ear in the center of his chest. I've got this grip. Now, I'm going to drive my knee in a little bit. There's two things that happen here. By driving my knee in, it gives me a better base and a place for my weight to sit. So if I come in here and drive my knee here, now my weight's on that knee. If it's back here and I lean forward, there's nothing. I need a place to pivot. So I drive my knee in first. I have this grip. I'm going to step up to the side. Now I'm ready, but i got to take my brake off first. Brake comes off. I'm going to throw my foot as far as I can behind him now. I'm pushing off and throwing my foot. So I push off, I throw it, drag the arm, I'm on top. Pretty simple. Pivot makes it all happen. That knee pivot you just drilled makes the whole technique work. If there's no pivot, it's not going. Nice and easy. Here, you got a foot going on. He's got a good front headlock on me now. There you go. All right. Now, I grab here. When I pull this, put my ear in the chest. I'm trying to put my ear right inside that cap. I don't want anything on the outside here. Nothing. Pulling across with the arm that's trapped. I'm reaching across here. I drive in with the inside knee. Not only does this give me a place to put my weight, but when I drive into him off that knee, he drives back, right? That'll help you with your pivot. So when everything's ready, I get up here, I take that brake off and push in a little bit, throw it out, and pull. Okay, that's slow. Move a little faster. <coughs> Arms trapped. My hands are closed. He's got a good front headlock on him. Come up. Secure the elbow. When I pull it, my ear goes into the chest. I'm looking out. Look out switch. All right? Drop the knee in. Post up. Drive in. Throw the leg. Okay, see where my foot in. It's back here. My brake shouldn't stop here. It should be here. And then I can switch in. I'm going to operate for you. Let's start working. Let me see one more time. Yes, yes, sir. Okay. Your front headlock switch. Mm -hmm. Fingers are closed. Grabbing with the arm that's trapped here. Pull in, look out. Drive forward on the inside knee. That's where my weight distribution is going right now. I step up. I've already got my brake off. I push in a little bit. He pushes back. I throw my foot. I throw him by. Okay? You guys got it? Sir, sir. sir. The pivot, if his energy is going forward, there's no, no longer anything blocking him. The arm drag happens on its own. Okay? Does that make sense? Yes, sir. Good. All right, let's do that three for three. One, two, three.